S named S, plural S is, is the 19th letter in the modern English alphabet and the ISO basic Latin alphabet. History Origin <inaudible> 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 Northwest Semitic sin represented a voiceless postalveolar fricative as in ship. It originated most likely as a pictogram of a tooth SN and represented the phoneme via the acrophonic principle. Greek did not have a phoneme, so the derived Greek letter sigma sigma came to represent the voiceless alveolar sibilant s. While the letter shape sigma continues Phoenician sin, its name sigma is taken from the letter samek, while the shape of samek but name and position of sin is continued in the shi. Within Greek, the name of sigma was influenced by its association with the Greek word sizo earlier asterisk sigj, to hiss. The original name of the letter, sigma, may have been san, but due to the complicated early history of the Greek epichoric alphabets, san came to be identified as a separate letter. S. Herodotus reports that san was the name given by the Dorians to the same letter called sigma. By the Ionians, the Western Greek alphabet used in Cumae was adopted by the Etruscans and Latins in the 7th century BC, over the following centuries developing into a range of Old Italic alphabets including the Etruscan alphabet and the early Latin alphabet. In Etruscan, the value, s, of Greek sigma, was maintained, while san represented a separate phoneme, most likely, transliterated as s. The early Latin alphabet adopted sigma, but not san, as Old Latin did not have a phoneme. The shape of Latin s arises from Greek sigma by dropping one out of the four strokes of that letter. The angular s shape composed of three strokes existed as a variant of the four-stroke letter sigma already in the epigraphy in Western Greek alphabets, and the three- and four-strokes variants existed alongside one another in the classical Etruscan alphabet. In other Italic alphabets Venetic, Lepontic, the letter could be represented as a zigzagging line of any number between three and six strokes. The Italic letter was also adopted into Elder Futhark, as Sawilo, and appears with four to eight strokes in the earliest runic inscriptions, but is occasionally reduced to three strokes, from the later 5th century, and appears regularly with three strokes in younger Futhark. Long S. The minuscule form, called the long s, developed in the early medieval period, within the Visigothic and Carolingian hands, with predecessors in the half-uncial and cursive scripts of late antiquity. It remained standard in Western writing throughout the medieval period and was adopted in early printing with movable types. It existed alongside minuscule, round, or short s, which was at the time only used at the end of words. In most Western orthographies, the gradually fell out of use during the second half of the 18th century, although it remained in occasional use into the 19th century. In Spain, the change was mainly accomplished between the years 1760 and 1766. In France, the change occurred between 1782 and 1793. Printers in the United States stopped using the long S between 1795 and 1810. In English orthography, the London printer John Bell (1745–1831) pioneered the change. His edition of Shakespeare in 1785 was advertised with the claim that he ventured to depart from the common mode by rejecting the long in favor of the round one, as being less liable to error. The Times of London made the switch from the long to the short s with its issue of the 10th of September 1803. Encyclopædia Britannica's fifth edition, completed in 1817, was the last edition to use the long s. In German orthography, long s was retained in Fraktur type as well as in standard cursive well into the 20th century, and was officially abolished in 1941. The ligature of or z was retained, however, giving rise to the est set, in contemporary German orthography. Use in writing systems Topic. The letter S is the seventh most common letter in English and the third most common consonant after T and N. 
It is the most common letter in starting and ending position, in English and several other languages, primarily Western Romance ones like Spanish and French. Final s is the usual mark of plural nouns. It is the regular ending of English third person present tense verbs. S represents the voiceless alveolar or voiceless dental sibilant, S, in most languages as well as in the International Phonetic Alphabet. It also commonly represents the voiced alveolar or voiced dental sibilant, Z, as in Portuguese mesa table or English rose and bands, or it may represent the voiceless palato alveolar fricative as in most Portuguese dialects when syllable finally, in Hungarian, in German before p, t, and some English words as «sugar» since yod coalescence became a dominant feature, and as in English «measure» also because of yod coalescence, European Portuguese islau Islam or, in many sociolects of Brazilian Portuguese, esdraculo in some Andalusian dialects, it merged with peninsular Spanish c and z and is now pronounced theta". In some English words of French origin, the letter S is silent, as in «isle» or «debris». The shish digraph for English — arises in Middle English alongside SCH, replacing the Old English SC digraph. Similarly, Old High German SC was replaced by SCH in Early Modern High German orthography. <laughs> Related characters Topic. Topic. Descendants and related characters in the Latin alphabet Topic. Latin letter long s, an obsolete variant of s Various forms of long s were used for medieval scribal abbreviations German estset or sharp s, derived from a ligature of long s followed by either s or z S with diacritics, SSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSSS
Topic: External links. Topic: Media related to S at Wikimedia Commons. The dictionary definition of S at Wiktionary. The dictionary definition of S at Wiktionary. S. The New Student's Reference Work, 1914.